goodbye root canals, endodontists may have to start looking for a new specialty. Stay tuned to find out why. Hi, I'm Heidi Dickerson, and welcome to LVI TV, your weekly dental news source. Have you ever had a root canal? If decay has damaged the nerve of your tooth, or if a tooth is infected, abscessed, or even dead, a root canal may be needed to save the tooth. During a root canal, a dentist or an endodontist removes the pulp from the center of the tooth and fills the pulp cavity. This can prevent the development of a painful infection and also can treat an existing infection that has developed into an abscess. The procedure generally stops the toothache, stops infection, and promotes healing. Have you ever used the phrase, I'd rather have a root canal? Especially when comparing worst case scenarios, the typical feeling about having a root canal is very negative, but this is all about to change. Researchers from Harvard University claim they have discovered a way to regrow parts of the teeth using lasers. Yes, you heard me right, lasers. How cool is that? This study cited below basically uses focused laser light on the rats to stimulate growth of any lost dentin. This could potentially change all of dentistry in the future. Researchers found that a growth factor, TGF-beta, changes with laser light. It actually stimulated stem cells. David Mooney, a very super smart professor, told foxnews.com, once TGF-beta is activated by the laser, it can bind to stem cells resident in the tissue, and then it induces those stem cells to differentiate so they can proliferate and reform dentin. Mooney makes it very clear that the laser cannot produce heat and that the power settings are very specific. How is all this being tested? Well, on our old friend, the rat. Researchers created tooth defects in some of these creatures. Basically, they drilled holes in their dentin. Then they used their lasers in the area, and after three months, the new dentin had formed. Seriously, this is amazing. It opens up a ton of possibilities for dentistry, as well as other areas of medicine. Can you imagine, instead of bonding a chipped tooth or undergoing a root canal, you could seriously heal the patient and regrow that part of their injured tooth? What will this mean for all of us as dentists out there? Who knows what the future holds? If this technology comes to fruition and it's the real deal, I'll be the first one to purchase one of these lasers and to heal my patients from within their own body's capabilities. This is truly enlightening. What are your thoughts on this new research? Please share them below. Don't forget to like us and subscribe, and I'll see you next time on LVI TV. I'm Dr. Heidi Dickerson.